when you put in fuel, when you go to the pump, you pump in $20 gas, I don't know how much you get these days, you get five gallons of gas. Again, you take it for granted that that dispenser is dispensing your five, your, your five gallons and that it's matching the correct price, right? That has been determined. But how do you determine that or how, how do you ensure that? Again, through calibration and verification of the equipment. Now there's a difference between both of them. When you talk about verification, it's taking a, a measuring instrument and determining whether or not it's meeting specific uh, requirements, perhaps manufacturer requirements. It's a pass fail criteria. Is it doing what it's meant to do? Yes or no. Yes, so it fails or it passes. Whereas calibration takes a measuring instrument and we compare it with another measuring instrument or reference that we know or we have confidence on what the status of this measurement is. The next time you go to the store and you make a purchase, next time you pump a gas, next time you go to your doctor, you know, think about the, those results that you're receiving and maybe even ask him this year or next, or next fiscal year, what we want to do is to do another survey to see what type of measuring instruments are out there again to see how the Bureau is going to further develop in terms of metrology.